good. <laughs> hey, how's it going, squad? Today we're gonna go on a little bit of an adventure with Julia, my sister. So it's gonna kind of be like a sibling tag. We are gonna go, we're gonna be going to the tax store. And then we're gonna probably go get our nails done. And then probably have lunch. And then I think she said she wanted to get her hair trimmed. So I'm gonna be bringing you guys along. We'll just kind of see where the day takes us. As per usual, I'm waiting on her. She told me half an hour, like 45 minutes ago. And yeah, so there we go. But you guys will be coming along, so get ready. The struggle game. <laughs> Eat that a little more obnoxiously. <laughs> Are we ready? Pinky up at all times when taking drinks. Pinky up. <laughs> Are we ready? We are ready. All right, we're ready. We're heading out. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go put my lipstick on. Oh my! Takes like two seconds. I'm gonna wreck you. You stink. So our fun fact of the day is that I did not know that Mitsubishi made tractors. Look at that bad boy. It's an old timer right there. Oh yeah. It is a sharp green. Six horses from. How much do you think she weighs? She weighs quite a bit. I know, this is 82, 11,000 pounds. We're probably Not 11,000, 100. Jesus, 1,100. I feel like it was. Mm, what about? No? Not feeling that one? I mean, I actually kind of do like that. Yeah, I kind of do white. like the white. What size is this yet? Yeah. Don't get purple. No, I'm not getting purple. What about this tan one? Too, too plain? Too plain Jane? This looks really tiny. It's only $12. Mm. Mm. I like the green. You like the green? I like the green. Alright, so we are in town. As you can see, there's Julia. She's at the ATM. Yep, there she is. Welcome to Mercer! Welcome to Mercer. This is about the only cool thing about Mercer. Is the courthouse. Oh, thanks, truck! Thanks! Pretty neat, though. Yeah, you get that ATM. Yeah, you get that money. Getting that money! Yeah, you get that money. I got him. Got him. Okay, so let's just, let's just take it from the top. What just happened to us? We got gypped so hard. Number one, Julia went to go get her hair cut and they charged her $15 to get her hair cut, which is fine. That's a decent price. That's a decent price for a haircut. And they proceeded to not cut her hair properly. It looked, she asked them for a dramatic V in the back and it literally just looked like straight across. So I was in the different hair salon because apparently uh, nobody wants to French braid. See, I got like these cornrow thingies, like fr they're not, they're not cornrows, they're like French braids. So I wanted to get those done. Well, the only place that would do it is the upstairs part, the salon, the upstairs part of J.C. Penney's, which I didn't even know existed. Well, it's about to be a mukbang as well, pretty much. <laughs> well, Julia comes upstairs. She's sitting in a chair. And the lady literally came into work and offered to fix Julia's hair. Offered to fix her hair for her. So, I'm thinking in my head, Julia's not gonna have to pay for this. She's just doing it as a favor to like get more clientele, pretty much is what I was thinking. So at the end of this, they charged Julia $22 
to recut her hair. So she paid 22 plus 15. No, plus 20. 20. Gave that guy oh, yeah, tip. she gave that guy tip. So it's $42. So $42 for a haircut today. And I wanted to get these cornrows in my hair, or French braids, whatever, in my hair because I just. I wanted a break for my hair. Like I literally just wanted a break. Like it's gonna I'm gonna I have a long weekend ahead of me, like I just wanted a break. So I was expecting like fifteen, maybe twenty dollars to do my hair. Charged me thirty two dollars to put braids in my hair. Thirty two dollars. Like and, they, and the braids aren't even like good. Like there's literally a piece of hair that they missed that she flattened down with hairspray. So we're like, okay, we're like, forget that place. We're never going back to the salon in the upstairs part of JC's JC Penney's, the upstairs salon in there. Swindle you out of your money and you're gonna get railroaded. So then we decide we're hungry. And since we just got ripped off pretty much, we're like, okay, we can't afford to go to go to like a nice lunch. We're basically gonna have to get fast food at this point because we're we're greedy and we like our money and we just got ripped off. So Wendy's, thank you, come through. <laughs> but no, Wendy's didn't come through because I we paid for two meals, and they gypped us on our fries. They couldn't even give us two fries. They gave us one fry. So the entirety of our day being spent together is called, hey, here, let's just get ripped off all day. That's how we want to spend our sister day. Sibling tag, shove it. Today can shove it. So next on the list is obviously, we haven't gotten our nails done yet. So we're probably gonna get ripped off again and I'll probably have a story about that. She couldn't even take five minutes to blow dry my hair while she was just sitting there for the next 20 minutes. Nope. Was just sitting there. Couldn't even dry her hair for her. It's fine. Whatever. It's lovely. I wanted to spend $300 today. Not? No, like I didn't want to. Oh. I'm about to. Yeah. Cause what, 50 at the 50? tag store? Mm -hmm. I just spent 50 here. Pretty yep, much. pretty much. And then another 100 in the store. I'm gonna get my nails done. Yeah, I'm not doing good pay here. I can't. I mean, I could, but I'm not. I don't think you were getting one anyway. Well, I wasn't even gonna get my nails done. And then I was telling Zach about it. He's like, what are you going to do today? And I was like, oh, I'm just going with Julia. We're going to go, like, hang out or whatever. And I told him how, like, he wanted to get your hair cut and go get your nails done and stuff. And I was like, but I'm just going to go just for, just to, like, go. And he was like, no, why don't you get your nails done? And I was like, well, because we're tight on money right now until, like, your paychecks start coming in. So I didn't want to, you yeah. know, spend unnecessary money. And he's like, no, just go do it. Hmm. He's like, well, we're fine. Yeah. Oh, that's nice of him. Yeah, it was very nice. Yeah, so. Comment down below if you've ever been ripped off. I like how you said that with a bunch of feet in your mouth. Yeah, relatable, okay? Relatable. <laughs> yeah. I like how that bitch was like, <laughs> she was like, she was like, are you diagnosing yourself with this brain odds? I'm like, okay, listen. Um, she was just like, she's like, like are, is this real? You diagnose yourself? Um, no, I got diagnosed when I was 13. This is a real disease. And it actually affects people pretty hard. 15% of the population, so it screw you. Who had the nerve? And then she like would interrupt me when I was talking to you. Like, what? Who are you? I don't know. That's why I was like talking. She was like, you know what sucks? And I was like, oh, sorry. I didn't realize that I wasn't talking. Yeah, forget that place. Oh my God. This couple is arguing as the... Yes! <laughs> that just made my day.
We didn't have this. I would have turned the camera so you could see that. But this old couple was literally arguing. <laughs> what were they arguing about? I don't know. Oh my god, that's the dude that cut my hair. Oh my god. <laughs> there he is. Oh my god. I gotta turn the camera. That's the guy. <laughs> that's literally the guy that screwed Julia's hair up and wasted $20. Look at him. It's because he's a ginger. Gingers don't have souls. Except for Mackenzie. Mackenzie, I love you. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, basically, uh, you can probably can't see me. <clears throat> basically, finish eating. And then, uh, we're gonna continue the progress in a progression of our day. <laughs> Right, so, so pretty much the nails went good for me anyways. Like I got this like chrome, Julia got like a flat gray. Yep, there it is. And she got a petty too, but I didn't get a petty. I just did a manicure. <sighs> However, okay, so the guy that I had do my nails was like really cool. And he was like really talkative. And his English was really good, which is a plus, because normally you can't understand anything that they're saying. But Julia's pedicure, like the first, the one lady cut her cuticles, and then the other Asian guy came over and cut her cuticles again. And then she was like bleeding. Now there's like dried, crusty blood, like all over her one big toe. And then like, all around your fingers pretty much too kind of yeah he like cut up her fingers like on the sides of them too so pretty messed up day I'm not gonna lie like pretty much something bad happened everywhere we went today so I think we're probably just gonna call it a day and we're just gonna go home at this point yeah what do you think Julia do you have any closing thoughts for our viewers we're freaking deucing it now. What? We're deucing. We're deucing? We're deucing. Deucing. Part two tomorrow. Yeah, stay tuned because we have to paint the porch tomorrow because that's what mom wants for Mother's Day. So there will be another video coming up tomorrow where I'm going to record us painting this porch. Should be interesting might time lapse some of it though like through the boring parts because obviously it's not going to be but I th it would be cool to like watch us move around real fast you know what I'm saying well not that late <laughs> yeah uh, all right well you know I'm just gonna leave the camera on in case anything cool happens like we wreck and die yeah I catch it on film you know what I'm saying <laughs> all right so at the tack at the tack store, the fly spray basically was 1875. Julia didn't realize it was 1875 because everything else in that store was dirt cheap. It was literally like two dollars, five dollars, whatever, blah blah blah. So basically, we got ripped off at the tack store too because she paid twenty dollars for, for uh, fly spray. Yeah. These are thirty-two dollar braids. What is this? What is this doing? Look at it. You see it? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. It didn't work. Yes. Yes, queen. Fuck. Coming to poke holes in all your little babies. Yeah. What? Get me out of this death trap. I found a very scary place in LA that I've never been to. Here we go. See theory. Move videos. your stupid souped up grocery gear! In like Mandela effect videos. Yeah. Anyways. Oh, so I just rewatched my snap start from last night. <laughs> so I just rewatched my snap story. I was like, that was like. Yeah. How you like that? Catch me outside! I'm going to open this umbrella in here. <laughs> I swear to God, if oh, you actually make me right Oh, that. the umbrella! <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Jolly O! The kingdom awaits! We're off to Neverland! <laughs> Is this what you wanted? Is this what you wanted? Audience, you want, you want to see me act like an idiot? Is that what you like? Is that what gets the views? Alright guys, well thanks for watching. We'll see you all later. Bye! Bye! Bye. I hate it when you do that. Make sure you guys are liking and subscribing. Alright, bye. I'm leaving this time for real. Bye!